Hi everyone, this is Sheila. Here is a quick process video of the boba shaker card that I made. Actually, I'm sorry, it wasn't a shaker card. It's um, using the boba shaker die set from Mama Elephant, but um, I just made a simple one layered card. And here you can see me using the dies to cut out the different um, components of the boba tea. Um, this is a big shot machine and you can see the metal dies I'm using um, and the metal dies go in between the two cutting plates and it cuts the paper right through um, um, when you roll the die through the machine. Um, here you can see the card coming together. I am cutting out the mats now. Usually I measure it out, but here I just wanted to show you a quick video. So I'm just eyeballing the size of the varying um, layers of the mats. You can see there's a the green layer, the yellow layer, and then the pink flower layer. And then now you're seeing the sentiment to my favorite QT that's also included in the boba shaker die set from Mama Elephant. And I just stamped it on there using um, Ranger Ink Archival Ink. Um, and I just die cut all the boba there. So those are the boba. And now I'm just layering on the cards. You want to use the largest mat on the bottom and then the second largest and then the smallest mat on top and that's the one with the stamped sentiment then here I am placing um, the die cut boba tea um, as you see there um, I had originally cut the tea elements on um, paper that I had already adhered adhesive on so this way it makes it easy for you to just peel and stick um, the reason why I did this is because the glitter paper sometimes it's hard to glue down with regular glue or with um, regular adhesive so with the um, scored adhesive the score tape adhesive um, it's much better and you can see I just added on the smiley face at the end thank you